Uh, I think we, we're looking pretty good as a group that, you know, doing position drills, like our individual periods. That, I mean, our freshmen are catching on pretty well. I think that we got a lot of learning to do as far as the install, but we're catching on pretty good. Uh, made a few mistakes, a lot of mistakes yesterday, actually, and we didn't have barely any today, so we did pretty good today, I think. You're, you're getting a lot of third team reps. Is that, did that surprise you? Uh, well, Coach told me that I was going to be down there with the three because of the, you know, the conditioning test and stuff. But I know that as far as my conditioning was, that I didn't get more in shape um, with the team so that I could be able to you know, run with the team. Was that, was that the issue then? Was just not in the kind of shape they wanted? Oh, yeah. That's, a, uh, that's definitely uh, one, of the, one of the issues that I need to be more in shape and I need to be more. Handle adversity, uh, you know, when it gets tough. That's what that's what I need to work on. So the question would be, why aren't you in the shape? Uh, in the shape that you need to be? The shape that I need to be is uh, my goal weight that I was at, I didn't quite make it yet. Okay. So um, as I was losing weight, um, the conditioning test came faster than my goal weight. So <laughs> that's definitely one of the issues. And another one of the issues is I won't complain, but the heat was definitely <laughs> one of the one of the problems with, with the uh, conditioning. So what's your goal with them? Where, where are they watching? Uh, they want me at 2 205. Okay. And you're at where right now? Uh, 210 right now. So I okay. uh, got about five more pounds to lose. So come out here and practice. That's, that's easy going to come off. But just got to continue to eat healthy and, and continue to stay in shape, continue to run. Uh, full speed of practice and you give 100%. Was 210 a high water mark for you this year in this offseason? Oh, no. Uh, I was set. I was at like 222 at one point, so definitely lost a lot of weight going into the camp, but got to continue to keep going. How did you get to 222? Uh, well, went back home. <coughs> uh, got too comfortable, so like, I knew that I should have stayed here for the for the summer, but uh, yeah, I just. That was, that was my main problem. When we talked after the spring, I mean, you, you said, you know, I want to be the starter. Mm -hmm. So what happened then in the summer if you had that goal to be the starter mm -hmm. that you didn't push to be like the starter? Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Well, uh, camp is not over yet, so yeah. I, I mean, I can still be the starter, but yeah. I'll just continue to keep working hard and continue to focus and just hopefully just continue to work and things come in my favor. It's definitely still what you want. Yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. Sorry. That's okay. I'm used to it. Sorry. You're, 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 it happens. My son. <laughs> that's crazy. <laughs> His last name is Junior, so, you know, that's my Junior right there. <laughs> When you, look at the, when you look at those young backs, and you had mentioned them, you know, what, what have you seen specifically, you know, out of Tario and, and Richie, I guess, the guys who are well, well, you can see it's still a drill that uh, uh, Richard, actually, can, he has a, a lot of power. And we went one-on-ones against the linebackers, I guess, two two days ago, and he had natural instincts that you know, none of us actually have, like throwing hips and throwing your hands. And he naturally brings his hands and it's, literally throws the linebacker off a little bit, he just don't throw his hips. So what he needs to work on is his hips. But he has natural natural hands of a blocker and obviously running over people is a natural for him. With Tario, he makes quick cuts. He can get up field north, south, mm -hmm. as quick as anybody on our team. Thank you. Thank you.